The Peaks Village in Summerlin. And that's what we're talking about today. So let's roll. roll. Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And I'm Damian Barton, Angela's sidekick. And today we're going to give you the most up-to-date information when it comes to the Peaks Village, or we should say Ascension. Ascension. Right? Aww. Ascension. Um, it, Ascension is a neighborhood in the Peaks Village, which is located in Summerlin South. And as you know, over the last few months, Damien and I have been doing updates of this community with awesome drone footage, right? Yes. So in the Peaks Village, you have two communities or builders, right? You're going to have Pulte at Ascension and Pulte at Ascension will have two single story communities and one two story community. And then you're going to have Toll Brothers at Ascension who will also have two single story communities and one single story community. The plan is for this to be built within a three to four year time frame. Okay. Right. But the shocking news is, as I mentioned, we have done a lot of drone footage. But before we talk about that, if you are thinking about buying in this community and want to learn more about it, call me at 702. 370-5112. And make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Anyway, so today Damien and I went down to the Peaks Village to get some new drone shots. Mm -hmm. And luckily it was open and all the roads were done. So we drove around and we were shocked because this whole time we thought that Incline was on one side of the community and Toll Brothers was on the other. But we were extremely wrong. And how it is, is that of the six communities, they're all mixed in together. Yeah. Which is kind of shocking. So we are going to go over what's going on with Pulte. And then we'll go over what is going on with Toll Brothers, as well as what type of amenities to expect and the HOA information. Ooh, good information. Good information. So let's get started. Pulte Homes at Ascension in the Peaks Village has already been doing pre-sales since late last year. This brand new community will have a total of 286 lots with three unique neighborhoods, Cap Rock at Ascension, Incline at Ascension, and The Point at Ascension. Pulte Homes at Ascension will feature 11 luxury one and two-story luxury home designs that range in size from 2,297 to 4,500 plus square feet. All three communities will be guard gated and there will be a desirable planned clubhouse within this community. So the nice thing is I have a great relationship of one of the sales reps that will be selling over there in uh, the Pulte community and her name is Mary Berry. So she's been feeding me a lot of information and she said that uh, there's reservations are now available from January home site release and that Pulte is now accepting reservations for home sites in all three communities uh, in their phase one only. So they had already done a lot of pre-sales in Incline and Caprock and they just opened up the point pre-sales. So it's going to be interesting, and I'm going to tell you per each collection how many homes have sold already just by doing the pre-sales, okay? Um, what else? So to secure your preferred lot, you'll need to complete a reservation form and provide a fully refundable $20,000 deposit. Um, this deposit can be made with a personal or cashier's check written to PGP title. And the good news is that this deposit will be credited towards your earnest money deposit, which is calculated at 8% of the total purchase plus a 20% deposit on the lot premium. Mm. Okay. Pulte also has a selection of home sites in the first phase of all three communities that are going to be kind of move in ready, but not really move in ready, but for a quicker move in. Okay. So each of the collections will have a one or two 
move-in ready type homes where you will not be able to select your options, but maybe flooring. So Pulte will be offering closing cost incentives and they will offer 3% of base price towards your closing costs or either buy down points so you can get a lower rate mortgage. However, you do have to use their in-house lender, which is Pulte Mortgage, and you do have to use a conventional loan only. And this could be for their quick move-in homes or for their um, homes that you're going to build from ground up. Now, they anticipate the models to open in spring of summer of this year. When we went there, again, we were quite shocked at the progress considering they have been pre-selling. The model home progress wasn't much. Right, yeah. yeah. It was very shocking, right? But they're selling. <laughs> they're selling, but the model homes uh, doesn't look much. Yeah, they haven't made it that far, have yeah, they? exactly. The first collection is Cap Rock at Ascension. Caprock offers three unique two-story home designs ranging in size from 3,981 square feet to 4,530 square feet with five bedrooms, four and a half to five and a half bathrooms, and three to four car garages. Prices are starting above $1.5 million for these. And the floor plans that they will have in this community are Passaro, Lucera, and Vittoria. Perfect. So in Cap Rock, they've already sold three lots and they have three available for sale and two move-in ready available right now. Um, Cap Rock is, has a slow selling because, you know, two-story homes, people like single-story homes. Now, when we get to Incline, they've already sold 11 lots and so we're gonna go further into detail about it, right? So Incline will have four different single story floor plans to choose from that range in size between 2297 square feet to 2466 square feet with three to four bedrooms, two to three and a half bathrooms, and three car garages. Prices starting at a little in the mid 900s, okay? And the floor plans that they will have in this collection is the Garden Gate, the Park Lane, the Genoa and the Cessna. And these are all very common single story floor plans by Pulte Homes. They're the medium size, mid size range homes. And you can find them pretty much anywhere in the valley, right? So they have sold 11 lots. Already. Already. And the lots that they have sold are 39, 45, 50, 55, 56, 58, 64, 109, 110, 111, and 113. They've been so secretive. How do they sell all these? They, no, they haven't been secretive like Toll Brothers. That's true. They have been doing pre-sales. So the lots that are available right now is lots 47, 48, 49, 57, and 108. And the move-in ready lot that they have is lot 104. The last home collection is the point at Ascension. The Point will offer four unique single-story home designs that range in size from 3,475 to 4,006 square feet, with three to four bedrooms, three and a half to four and a half bathrooms, and three car garages. Prices will be starting at above $1.5 million. The floor plans that they will have in this community will be the Royalty, the Dignitary, King's Gate, and the Luminary. Nice. Yeah, the luminary. These are big. the monster, monster, monster single story homes. And they had a few of these uh, homes at one point in time in the Reverence community in oh. Summerlin. Uh, the King's Gate is uh, what we saw today. It was like a huge footprint. Mm -hmm. So um, now, when you buy in any of these communities, they're going to have different lot premiums, right? So what my sales rep says is lot 76 and 78 is going to have a lot premium of 75000 Lot 75, which is only going to be for a King's Gate, is going to be 165000 Lot 42 through 47, the lot premiums are going to be anywhere between hundred to 200000 And then lot 71, the premium's two hundred, And then lot 72 and 73, they've already sold. Gone. Gone. And lot 74 is another move-in ready home. And then the average lot size at the point is around 11,000 square feet. But the King's Gate, because it's the largest 
footprint is over 13,000 square feet. Get a little more room on that one. Exactly. Now we're gonna head into Toll Brothers at Ascension. And as we mentioned in the beginning of this video, Toll Brothers is not on one side and Pult is not on the other, it is intermixed in between. <laughs> Now, Toll Brothers has been very secretive, right? But as of now, what Toll Brothers did was they had formed a VIP list. Mm -hmm. And if you were really, really, really interested, then you had to fill out another buyer questionnaire. So Toll Brothers has been super duper secretive about what they have been selling. Okay, right? Mm -hmm. You very. I mean, I've had clients interested in it, and what they're doing is they have about 300 people on their VIP list. So they're going in order, trying to qualify the buyers and then sell the lots per collection. The, granted, there's only 274 lots. Right. Over 300 people are interested, and I'm sure that list will grow. But they have been secretive because they haven't really announced to the public, like Pulte Homes has, what lots have really sold or that they have been doing this pre-selling. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I mean, it's kind of crazy. So the good thing is Damien and I, again, drove through this entire community and was quite shocked with the little signs that we saw with a lot number sold. A lot of sold. A lot of sold per each of the collections. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, what? I'm trying to get my clients in there <laughs> and they've already sold a lot of lots. Mm -hmm. um, so it's kind of interesting how this is all going to play out. And they haven't let us know when they're going to open up their model homes. Now, the interesting thing is when we went there, Toll Brothers, who has not been really advertising like Pulte, seem more further along than Pulte. Wasn't that a surprise? Because yes. we didn't hear much. So. We didn't hear much. Mm -hmm. The model homes for Toll Brothers seem like they're almost done. Right. Unlike the Pulte model homes. And also, they had a lot of lots being built with the Toll Brother communities. Now, granted, these homes, because they're bigger, they're going to take a long time to build. 10 plus months, 12 plus months. And if you know anything about Toll Brothers, they tend to take longer than that. They do. They take a while. Yeah. But... And they also had some move-in ready homes that had the little sold sign. And they were f further progressed than the move-in ready homes that Pulte has. So yeah. we were shocked, right? <laughs> In a good way. Yeah. yeah. The first collection is Ridgeline. And Ridgeline offers 74 single-story homes with three distinctive luxury home designs ranging in size from 3,415 plus square feet to 3,615 plus square feet with four bedrooms, four and a half baths, and three car garages. This collection will have a stunning mix of modern, mid-century modern, and desert contemporary exteriors. Anticipated pricing will be around 1.5 million. Which is kind of shocking because when they first announced this community, they said that it was gonna be 1.4. Already gone up. And it's already gone up 100,000. Mm -hmm. Now there's three collections in this particular community, the first one is Satinwood, then Silverstone, and the third is Sunfire. They have already sold 15 lots in this collection. What? I mean, mind blowing. I'm completely shocked. I was like, what? What am I missing out on? You have clients who want to get in this community and you're learning out that these are already selling. Yeah. So the lots that they have sold so far was 27, 28, 29, 30, 34, 35, 38, 39, 40, 42, 43, 48, 73, 74, and 75. The lots that they had available at the time when we saw it was 31, 32, 33, 37, 49, and 50. And the move-in ready lots were 25 and 36. Now, if you go to Toll Brothers' website for this particular collection, they don't say anything about lots sold or anything that's available or nothing. I mean, they were so secretive. So if you really wanted to get into this community, reach out to me because now I know better um, and I know how to get in and what you need to do to get in. Now, the thing is, the lot premiums in this community, not just particularly Ridgeline, but in this whole entire community is going to range up some of them in a million dollars. I heard that from a client that 
finally got a hold of the Toll Brothers sales rep, and they said a million dollars, some of them 400000 For a lot premium. A lot premium. Now, to circle back, I forgot to mention, um, the lot premiums over at Caprock over there uh, in, by Pulte, the ones that have the views of the city, are around 300000 And that's just a lot premium. It was a beautiful view, though. It is, you know, they said that they had high elevation views, but as you can see the video that I'm just showing you right now, it's actually surprising that there were views of the strip. So I was quite impressed with some of the views that they did have offer in there. Okay, I'm over here at High Rock by Toll Brothers and driving around this whole new Peaks Village Ascension. It's kind of confusing, but the elevation here is pretty good because as you can see, there are some awesome uh, views of the strip. So right straight ahead is Crestline, and then right over here is going to be um, Incline by Pulte. And then you'll have Cap Rock, and then you'll have the point over here by Pulte as well. So it's kind of interesting to see how this is unfolding. The next collection is High Rock, and they offer 96 luxury single story homes with expansive floor plans and the awe inspiring views. Now, this is the one that we saw that had the higher elevation views. I mean, those views were beautiful. Um, and this collection offers three distinctive home designs ranging in size from 3623 plus square feet to 3940 plus square feet with three to four bedrooms three and a half to four and a half bathrooms and three car garages. The prices are starting in the $1.6 million range. And the floor plans that they will have in this collection is the Cliffside, the High Crest and Sky Edge. The lots that have already sold in High Rock was two, 91 and 92. And the lots available was one, three and four. Hmm. So they didn't have as much selling yet on this collection as the previous the Ridgeline Collection. Mm -hmm. And the last community is Crestline Collection. The Crestline Collection offers 104 two-story home designs that range in size from 4,783 square feet to over 4,998 square feet with featuring five bedrooms, five and a half bathrooms, and three car garages. Prices starting from 1.8 million. The three floor plans that'll be offered at Crestline are the Rosecrest, the Summer Hill, and the Suncrest. And they have already sold 11 lots in this community. They've sold lot 5, 7, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, and 65. And the lots available that we saw was lot 6, 8, 9, 10, and 11. Kind of interesting um, how they're starting the lots because they're all over the place. Yeah. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yeah, it's kind of um, Because bit. normally when a community opens up, they have a certain section that they sell it in and then they move closer to the models. But this one was like all over the place, not just in Crestline, but also in the rest of the um, Toll Brothers communities. Right, it was all over the place. Yeah. So when we were there, we noticed um, a big plot of land where the big amenity center is going to be. And it's going to be between the High Rock by Toll Brothers and then the Point by Pulte Homes. The amenities that they're gonna have is the whole community is guard gated. They're gonna have a big clubhouse with a resort style pool and also a lap pool. Um, they're gonna have a jacuzzi. They're gonna have an expansive recreation center, indoor great room with fireplace, a beverage bar with seating area, a large outdoor terrace, a social room, an aerobic studio, a state-of-the-art fitness center, Amazon parcel Ooh. lockers, um, outdoor event lawn, as well as pickleball courts. So again, this reminds me, as I mentioned in a couple of my other videos, it's a marriage between Mesa Ridge by Toll Brothers and Reverence by Pulte Homes. They had a baby and it's <laughs> called Ascension and they're having the similar amenities that they have in each of those two communities, right? But the most important thing too is the HOA information. Um, so the HOA at Ascension is going to be $255 a month. The HOA for Summerlin South is 65. So the total HOA is $320, 
But the shocking news is there is no SIDS. Huh. No SIDS. I've never heard of a community in Summerland that had no SIDS. They had streets. They had streets. <laughs> they had structural. Right, electrical. Yeah. Plumbing. So that's pretty cool that a first is a first that the Peaks Village does not have SIDS. Hmm. <laughs> So, as you can see, this community is fast. It's growing fast. Mm -hmm. okay? And selling fast. And selling fast. Shockingly, in this real estate market, you would not think that they would be selling these mid-million dollar homes, but they are selling pretty well. They're high price points. They're high price points and they're selling very well. Now, it's important, I always say, when you want to get into a community, it's better to get in the beginning of the community than it is at the end of the community. Prime example, when Mesa Ridge opened up, they were starting in the eight nine $900,000 range and they're probably up to $3 million. So you want to make sure you get in the beginning because every time they release lots, the prices do increase, even now in this mm. crazy market, right? Another thing I want to say is, it's important before you look at the models and before you sign up that VIP list or you want to get in the pre-sale list, contact your favorite Las Vegas realtor mm. because I work hand in hand with these builders and their agents. And, you know, especially if you don't live in state, right? right? Um, I'm here to guide you throughout the entire process. I sell a lot of new construction in Summerlin and across the Las Vegas Valley. I am your new home sales expert. I am free of charge. So why not use me as an expert to you without having to use that sales rep? Because I can go down there and make videos if you're not there. Take photos of the lot if you're not there. Do the um, pre-drywall construction or the frame walkthrough for you if you're not there. I do everything if you're not there because oftentimes a lot of clients are from out of state. She does it all the time. Anyways, folks, if you are interested, call me at 702-370-5112. And if you want to learn more about this community, I have posted a link to a blog post down in the description below. Or you could go to my website at neighborhoodsinlasvegas.com where I have a link for this village, which is the Peaks Village. Thank you guys so much for watching. But most importantly, before I forget, hit that thumbs up button and subscribe. <laughs> Bye, guys.